Good day, Tragic here, and this is just a quick video because a lot of people are having a real issue with my mass import tool. Uh, if you need to know how to use this tool, please check the other video on the mod page. But basically, this tool allows you to take an object, paste URLs into these lists, and then copy all those U URLs onto you know, so you can make hundreds and hundreds of tokens in seconds rather than hours. Okay, now the problem with this is in the demo, uh, I use Dropbox, which I just got all the links individually. But the problem with this is if you actually, uh, the way it works is, is that line one matches with line one. So line one of this list is the front, line one of this list over here is the back. Now, when you go to Google, if you use Google Drive, if I go into my Google Drive, uh, just go into my mass demo duh. Now, if I copy all the Google links and go share copy links, and I paste them in, That'll work. That's how you. That's how I do my mods. I just do it like that. So boom, these copy, everything's fine. But the problem is, they actually aren't in order, right? So the Google jumbles the file order. So seven is now on the ten. You know, it's all out of order. Okay. So I get a lot of people asking me, how do I get my links from Google Drive in order? And there's basically a couple of different applications that allow you to do this. Uh, there is something called File Cabinet, I think it's called. File Cabinet is the one I usually use, but there's a, it, they haven't updated recently to the latest Google Drive. They, they're usually like a week or two behind. I just chose the wrong time to do this video. Uh, but the other one I also use quite a lot is this thing here, the Direct Link Google Drive whatever. If you just type into Google uh, file cabinet Google Drive, you'll find file cabinet. If you type into Google direct link generator Google Drive, you'll find uh, this site. Now the way this one is individual file lines, you can just paste in here, hit generate and it, the direct link will come out here. Very, very cool. But you can also, he's also got his own uh, direct drive link spreadsheet thing as well, which is basically the same thing as file cabinet. So the way it works is you, this button that says launch will say install uh, if you haven't got it installed. And then you go to your uh, actual drive, okay? And you just start a new spreadsheet, okay? Now, if, then you then you go to add-ons and you'll have uh, add-ons. You'll have direct drive links in here, and you can just go generate links. Now, direct drive links does have a premium monthly payment, but it's free for any kind of practical use that I use it for. Uh, the The limitation is that you can only have one spreadsheet instead of separate spreadsheets for each of your directories. So when I hit generate link, it's going to load my existing sheet, okay? Which I've emptied to make it a little clearer. So the way it works is now that I've got a work my working sheet, I just hit add-ons, direct drives, and I'm gonna go select folders for links. And I'm just gonna go select folders. You can do all your folders. It just takes a long time if you've got a billion things. I'm just gonna go add folder. I'm going to come down, I'm going to go temp, mass demo, select, and then I'm just going to hit generate, you blam. And now it's going to go through all the files in that folder and create a spreadsheet of them. And there's various options you can use, I'm just using default. So as you can see, we now have a nice spreadsheet of all the data. Okay, perfect. But you can see that it's pulled it in 
out of order. You see it's 10, 3, 0, 9, 7, whatever. So it's pulled it in out of order in the same way it's out of order when, you know, when I imported it before. But because this is a spreadsheet, I can now click on the column and I think it's in data here, yeah, sort column C, A to Z, bam, and it's now reordered this list by file name. And of course, depending on what col column you use, you can do it by directory, you can do it by whatever, I do file name, and now they're all in order. So now if I just go to uh, here, let's click on one to 10, and I just go control C for copy. I just come in here, let's uh, just clear all this out. And then I just copy this in, and now I hit generate, it's, taking the list again, but this time it's an ordered list. So everything is coming out in the correct order. And that is how you get ordered links out of Google Drive. Again, links will be in the description. I'll put it in the mod page and I'll also put it in the description of this video. Direct link generator is what I just used. I quite like this one. This is the one I mainly use. But recently I've been using one called File Cabinet, which just has a bit of a slicker interface, uh, but uh, it's no longer, it won't let me install it on my new computer. It says that Google Drive hasn't verified it since the update, which usually means it'll be verified soon. But Direct Link definitely 100% works. The good thing about File Cabinet is that it is completely free, which means you can have separate spreadsheets per directory. Uh, the Direct Link one is, not like that, you can only have one spreadsheet. But like I said, it doesn't make any difference. And that's it. Uh, yeah, so I hope that helps for the people who constantly are asking. I'll see you guys next time.